let me ask you uh what what was this what i had so much things written on man and yeah uh, i don't have a line that's i'm i'm a bad uh, guess because i i always jump to yeah don't worry well when, when uh, I, when you're I not a, you're a great guest uh okay. let me let me uh, ask you okay let's go back to cooking so uh about the pasta what's the you know what's the biggest secret when you cre- when you create home made pasta so do we, you mean the, the dough for pizza no the pasta like spaghetti you know okay and uh, other stuff okay do um, you do you do it in your restaurant when i order let's p- say spaghetti? pasta okay let, let, let's i'm a guy from the south in the south we don't have fresh pasta okay we have gnocchi of course but fresh pasta, uh, we don't have fresh pasta. We have this dry one. Actually, Gragnano, the place where I, I grew up, mm-hmm. is the European city of pasta. Okay. Because of this uh, Romanian building, the we created uh, on purpose that the wind from the mountain to the way to the to the coast to the sea was uh, always this little breeze, so the pasta was drying really fast in a ah, effective nice. way. Yeah. yeah, I mean the in Gragnano all the the old building, there you don't have flat on the on the on the prism, yeah. uh-huh. not first floor, prism, yeah. the prism. I don't know, I'm saying English. You have all, only apartment on the first floor, okay? Because this uh, this ground zero is the prism is basement. It uh, is basement. basement yeah, doll, huh? okay. Prism. So ground zero. Okay, okay, okay. Prism. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I apologize if I mix English and Croatian. No, it's beautiful. <laughs> uh, so yeah, so we have mostly dry mm-hmm. pasta. Fresh pasta is from the north. Uh, uh, so the question is, what how, how to make pro- proper uh, pasta at home? Yeah, that's the or like the mix for uh, uh, egg. Uh, uh, egg and uh, I'm, flour and yeah i'm talking uh, i'm asking in uh, in general so uh, croatian people okay. uh, people on the balkan are used to buy this most of it it's not good pasta uh, which is from the supermarkets ah okay okay, okay. L- listen me. okay uh, okay so i just want to make the point uh, that you actually tell us what is the the great pasta so people uh people are kind of you know surprised when they try the real pasta mm-hmm. not the not yeah. the supermarket pasta you know yeah okay uh now in zagreb uh, you have this um i cannot say the names but uh, these big stores mm-hmm. uh where you can find specific uh pasta uh normally it's kind of a good index uh trafilata bronzo it means uh, uh, bronze. Ah, okay. Gotcha. Uh, true bronze um, m- metal form. Mm-hmm. Basically, w- what does it mean? That what happens? You, you make the dough. Uh, great pasta, by the way, is made from another uh, piece of pseudo. I just say pseudo. Anyway, pseudo. Uh, Everybody knows what is pseudo. Yeah. Um, it's not correlated to 0001 integral. So it's, it's another piece. Pšenično, brav. It's pšenično, pardon. Okay. Pšenično. But it's not this. In, in Italian, we call it weak or hard. Okay. In the south, mostly grow the hard one, which is the same family, but a different piece ah, okay. of pšenično. Uh, normal pšenično, which you, we use for Napoletana, for uh pesto pedeset glatko yeah the, the flour we have also here in croatia is oblong really similar to rice a little bit smaller than rice and uh with a little a, a lot of um this um how do you say in english uh ca- carbo side okay uh, s- side so really performing on a technical way this du- um, du- durum um also called actually semolina Everybody Simone, now yeah, is Temola yeah. and Semolina. Yeah, yeah. That's, um, that's the Durum, which is a different species. It's round, uh, has more, more quality, more uh, also quality. What is quality, what is not quality. That's a big, yeah. we can talk about this later. Uh, I discovered this, how to, what is quality, what is not quality. 
re recently. Yeah. Um, anyway, it's round, smaller. Uh, on a uh, industrial in an industrial point of view, is weaker than the the, the other one because the reza reza is inferior mm -hmm. on on, uh, on gluten. Uh, the gluten is uh, I don't know, let's say less quality gluten because why? It's a shorter protein, mm -hmm. not mm -hmm. a big protein like we can have on the zero zero flour okay. or Manitoba. So what happened? And basically, we have a lot of, and grows really fast. You don't, it doesn't need. It's easier actually to cultivate it. Mm -hmm. So in the south, we have this kind of grains. Uh, we basically make everything from the grains: uh, gnocchi, pizza, uh, pasta, mm -hmm. everything, e e e even cake from mm -hmm. this kind of, and bread, of course. I don't know if I say bread and bread, of course. Uh, w what you have? Then you have a lighter product. And it's a, a little bit more yellowish. If you see the pasta, if you compare two pasta, let's say an industrial known blue packet pasta yeah. is white or translucent. If you buy, I don't know, Di Martino, Garofalo, um, Viello, uh, Di Viella. Anyway, this new brand, they're coming to Zago. They're coming. Okay. And um, you'll see, you recognize they're a little bit yellowish. That's because of the color of the flower. So uh, anyway, they, they do this mix. Okay. Uh, they just go through this kind of press, this machine, and they, where you have the, this form of pasta. You have paccheri, you have spaghetti, you have linguine, you have farfalle, bow ties, farfalle is uh, bow tie, uh, penne, which is my favorite. Uh, you have this kind of shape, but actually come from the same dough and the same grain. Yeah, yeah. just a different shape. Yeah. And... Um, a, perf a perfect way is really simple. Of course, you'll tell me, yeah, for you, it's really simple. Because if you know, I, I grew up with that. So for me, I was not even understanding the question. So, you know, it, yeah. for me, it's obvious. Yeah, but it's, tell us, tell us, what's the, uh, you know, perfect way of making homemade okay. pasta? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay, that's the, that's the question. You buy the packet of pasta, this hard. Uh, in every packet, you have the timing of how, how much this... Needs have, to be cooked, yeah. Yeah, a minute, in a minute. So basically you need a pot. Normally, it's, there is also a ratio, which I do by heart, but actually there's a mathematical formula. I think it's 100 grams, one liter of water. Okay. No, that's too much. Uh, that's too much because half a kilo, you need five liters. No, that's too much. Anyway, you need enough water. Okay, let's say the double. Mm -hmm. 200 grams, at least you need half a liter of water. Okay. Anyway. Don't take my number by by by, by low. Need to be enough uh, enough water. Need to boil. When it's boiling, you put salt. When boiling. When boiling, because uh, well, it, it boils faster. That's also it's a couple of seconds. But there is this meat uh, that uh, salt um, salt water salty water yeah. uh, take more time than not salty water. Mm -hmm. But anyway, it, yes, it is. Of course, in the restaurant, it matters because if you want to boil 50 liters of water like we do in Papavero, it takes 10 minutes less than 15 minutes less if it's salty or not salty. Yeah. Anyway, it needs uh, details that, that um, I'm sick in the head. So, <laughs> so it's, I have this kind of... <laughs> and uh, anyway, salty water. How much salty? By whatever your taste is. So you are cooking for yourself and people you love at the end, right? If you're home, you are cooking for someone you love, you just taste it. If you like it, think of the people, uh, the person you are cooking for, and you will have the answer. Okay? Sure. It's not only number and mathematics. Yeah. Anyway, when it's boiling, you put the pasta in, not before. Of course. And um, the moment you put pasta in, you set a timer. Or look at the watch. Respect the minute is on the packet. That is important. To be al dente. Okay. To be al dente. Exactly. What happened now? What I do? What actually also my mom do and my grandmother do is when pasta is almost done with a cup, cup, ceramic cup, coffee or big cup or milk, yeah. cafe latte, you take some of the water. 
Why not before? Because when pasta is almost done, all the what's name? Shkrob. Mm-hmm. Shkrob. Anyway, that became Shkrob Navada. Mm-hmm. That is um, term I found also now. Uh, they're using this uh, amid, uh, uh, amid, not amid. Anyway, doesn't matter. Scrub navoda. You just take some and put on the side. Uh-huh. Maybe you'll need, maybe not. Just put it there. Take your your pot, close the gas. You you're not gonna need the gas anymore for water. Yeah. Strain the water and keep it pasta. That pasta now that you have is al dente. What you want to do with that pasta is another story. Sure. Of course, the recipe change. If you want to do pasta pomodoro, is one thing. Which kind of pomodoro is one thing. Mm-hmm. A liquidy, a li- if you have a liquidy sauce, you need to saute the pasta. Mm-hmm. And then, if you saute the pasta, you need that liquid for the right creaminess. Yeah. To, to get creamy. If you have some dry sauce, I don't know. Like it, it can be some gamberi pesto sherry right it's a bosiak mm-hmm. right in maslina that yeah. you don't have a sauce you basically it's kind of dry and you use that scrub na voda mm-hmm. in the restaurant what do we do we have the big pot you just with a with a spoon chefia 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 yeah. you just take some water to the right creaminess if you have some i don't know uh, also carbonara carbonara is creamy but it's actually dry yeah. Because you don't you, you don't you don't have a sauce. You have a carbo crema now, uh, and use this scrub navoda to to the right creaminess. Yeah. And then you just sauté, sauté, sauté. You see that. Yeah. If you have some, I don't know, tell me something. Bolognese. Uh, bolognese with not too much onion. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but it's uh, you. You uh, you just explain with bolognese. You know, which, you have the sauce. With, yeah. You just have this pasta. So I, I'm 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 done. I'm done. You have this pasta. Put it in bolognese sauce. You just need to mix it. You need yeah. even to shoot it. You just mix it with spoon or whatever, and then it's done. 